More and more farmers are spraying at night these days, whether it's to take advantage of lower wind speeds at night or just in an effort to cover more acres. But spraying at night makes it somewhat difficult to see how well your nozzles are working, at least it has been until now. This new boom lighting system makes night spraying much easier, according to Bob Letkeman of ATI Agritronics, based out of Winfield, BC. Night spraying has always been an issue. Uh, seeing the crop clearly, seeing your spray pattern is always an issue. And uh, so the importance of having a down-facing light that uh, allows you to see your spray pattern and the crop uh, is, is a significant deal for, for agriculture. Having the lights on the booms is helpful, but they went one step further by strobing the lights. This makes it much easier for the operator to do boom checks. You're at the boom and you would, you would turn on your, your spray, either with a remote boom control or from the cab, and uh, then you would set the mode from, from solid to strobe, and uh, I'll just uh, demonstrate that for you. So on the, on the strobe feature, we pulse the uh, LED very rapidly uh, and it gives us the same effect as a, as a timing light would do or a strobe light in a, in a, in a bar. Uh, and it just allows you to see that spray pattern very clearly. The lighting system design was kept as simple as possible and allows them to be installed on just about any sprayer, self-propelled or pole type, including this New Holland unit. You get a bracket, we call it a paddle. Uh, the, the paddle serves uh, uh, two purposes. One is to position the LED so that we get the proper angle of light on the spray. And the second is to serve as a, as a backdrop so when you're doing your boom check and you're strobing the, uh, the uh, uh, spray that you have a reference point so you can see your, see your uh, pattern on your spray very much clearer. Because you are illuminating the spray uh, if you've got a plug nozzle, it, you have a black hole there and it, it shows up very uh, clearly and very easily. The system is patented, which means it's unique, both in its actual strobe lights and how the units mount on the sprayer. The bracket has a, a cable way in it uh, so that we uh, cannot put any tension on the, on the LED. We don't no tension on the, on the cable. Uh, so it, it serves as a cable way and then it's fastened to the boom uh, with uh, zip ties. Even though the most noticeable benefit of having the lit booms comes at night, these lights can also be quite helpful during the day. A lot of times you can only see the spray pattern on one side of your sprayer or the other side. With the lights it will illuminate the spray enough so that you can see the spray uh, even in a, in a in a sunny day with, uh, with clouds in the, in the sky. It'll make a difference. Letkerman told us most LED lights are rated to last at least 50,000 hours, which should be around 20 years when used on a sprayer. He said installing the paddle and the four lights on each nozzle is relatively simple, but you should allow six to 10 hours to get the job done. Just wires into your 12 volt system, takes very little current being LEDs. Uh, uh, 96 lights takes less than 6 amps of power, so very, very low power. Not only can the system be turned on from the cab or by remote, it can also be controlled with a smartphone. We have an app to, uh, to control the booms remotely. So our app uh, works on an Android or an Apple uh, phone and uh, we can control up to 11 boom sections uh, with the app. We have a jog feature in, in the app, so you can, as you're walking down your boom, you can literally turn on and off each boom section as you're just walking down. Letkeman says farmers have shown a lot of interest in taking advantage of this feature, as well as the technological advantages which appear to be just around the corner. And with the technology, uh, there's just a lot more information that we'll be able to give to the farmer in the future, uh, such as uh, location of where, where they did uh, the boom checks, which booms they checked. So there'll, there'll be a lot more information uh, that we'll be able to feed back to the, to the farmer over time. So uh, as technology changes and you have individual nozzle control, we'll be able to incorporate that into our, into our uh, uh, remote boom control. The system is sold in individual kits. At the time of our visit, kits were available with 48, 64, 80, and 96 lights. 
You can use it on 20 inch spacing, 15 inch spacing, 10 inch spacing. Uh, a lot of versatility in the way the, the product is designed, so uh, you can use it in numerous different applications. The cost of equipping a sprayer with this high intensity LED lighting system would depend on the size of the sprayer. Letkeman told us $2,000 would buy you a kit for a 120 foot sprayer with 20 inch nozzle spacing.